Hey, what up, G fans? So y'all looking to groove tonight in the club? And while smelling good, we'll look no further because your boy got you. In today's video, I'll be going over top 10 fragrances that you can pull out of your back pocket for the club. These fragrances are going to have these ladies going crazy over you. So with no further ado, let's dive right into it. Boys, so coming in at number 10, we have Wanted by Night. So this fragrance is some nice, warm, spicy cinnamon fragrance with some nice fruity notes that makes this fragrance delicious. This fragrance has some awesome longevity and awesome projection and it will make you notice. If you haven't checked this fragrance out already, please do so. At number 10, we have a Zorro Wanted by Night. So coming in at number 9, boys, we got Stronger with you. This fragrance is a warm, spicy vanilla fragrance and it's a tension grabbing scent. So just like the previous fragrance, this fragrance also has good longevity and awesome projection that's gonna make you notice. So if you're looking for some compliments and looking for something a little different from the previous fragrance, well check this fragrance out because this fragrance is just as good. Coming in at number nine, we have Stronger with you. So coming in at number eight from the house of MFK, we have Grand Swore. Now this fragrance has a basic note breakdown, but don't let it fool you. This fragrance is a vanilla almond scent and it is good, people. It is a monster in the projection department. This fragrance is just good. To me, it is a masterpiece. This fragrance will check off almost everything in your List longevity, projection, compliments you name it, this fragrance will deliver. So, if you haven't heard of this fragrance, this fragrance is known as Grand Swore. So, check this fragrance out at number eight. Coming in at number seven is the fragrance that started the woman's apocalypse. Coming in at number seven, we have Annie. This fragrance is a sexy gourmand fragrance and it is delicious. The ladies love it and people, I am gonna tell you, they're gonna want to devour you. If you're not ready to get those girls coming after you, well don't bring this fragrance out because this is a ladies magnet. At number seven, we have from the house of Nishani, Annie. So coming in at number six, it's a very sexy fragrance and it's very popular for the club nights. And that fragrance is Versace Eros EDP. This fragrance is an aromatic citrus fragrance that's gonna make you feel sexy. If you don't care about smelling different, you just want to smell good and want to wear something that works 100% of the time, we'll pull this bad boy out because it's popular for good reason. At number six, we have Versace EDP. Now we heading down to our top five fragrances and telling you these fragrances are good. Coming in number five from the House of Perfume de Mali, we have Herod. This fragrance is just straight up sex in the bottle with that tobacco, vanilla, and that sexy cinnamon that the ladies love. So you're looking to smell different from people around you? Well, check this fragrance out because this fragrance is going to do just that. This fragrance has awesome longevity, awesome projection, and it's going to have you feeling good. Check this fragrance out at number five. From the House of Perfume de Mali, you have Herod. So coming in at number four, it's another popular fragrance that has the title of King of Clubbing. Coming at number four, we have from Bacarabon, we have one million. So this fragrance is just straight up sexy. Coming off with that warm spice, citrus note, and some cinnamon is just sexy and alluring. So like I mentioned before, this fragrance is very popular and has the title of King of Clubbing. So if you don't care about smelling different and just want to smell good, well check this fragrance out at number four. You have Baca de Bon 1 million. Now we down to our top three fragrances and people, these three was hard to decide who was gonna get number one. But I chose and coming in at number three, we have Le Mans Le Parfum from the house of Jean Paul Gaultier. Boys, this fragrance, it is good, it is beast, it is God tier. 
let me give you a breakdown of the notes so you can have an idea what I'm talking about. This fragrance start off with that nice cardamom going into that sexy lavender and iris and it finish it off with that vanilla boys you should know now why this fragrance is just good and mouth watering it's gonna make those girls melt and guess what those panties are gonna drop coming at number three we have john paul lamar la Parfum. So you no longer want to be basic, you want to be a man. Well check this fingers out at number two, we had Dior Elixir. This is a complete upgrade from the original Dior line of Sauvages. This fragrance is a compliment getting fragrance and it is good. So if you're trying to walk into the club feeling nuclear and want to be noticed when you walk in and not give a damn while smelling good, well boys, check this fragrance out at number two, cause it is beast in every aspect. At number two, we have Dior Elixir. So yes, this last fragrance was chosen to be number one because I was being biased. I love this fragrance and it is one of my go-to fragrance for the fall in winter. That is, from the house of Zerjov, we have Noxos. This fragrance has some vanilla, one of the most sexy accord, with some honey, tobacco, and some lavender. So do I need to say more? This fragrance is just sexy and it is good. It is one of my favorite fragrance in my collection. If you haven't put your nose on this fragrance, oh boy, check this fragrance out because you don't know why I was being biased. At number one for the house of Zerjaw, we have Noxos. Peace!